Hey everyone, hold on to your seats because what I'm about to share is absolutely mind-blowing. So last week, Elon Musk drops a tweet on X. You know the platform formerly known as Twitter. And the whole world was both thrilled, at the same time was shocked. Musk is no stranger to stirring the pot, but this time, Neuralink's update caught everyone's eye and no one expected it will come this much sooner. Neuralink, in case you are wondering, is one of Musk's many ventures, but it's not just another company. It's the one that seems to throw curveballs at him left, right and center. So what's the big deal with Neuralink? Imagine, you want to turn on a fan without moving a muzzle. Just think it and it happens. You play a video game without requiring a controller or joystick. You play directly from thinking. This is not a plot of sci-fi novel. Neuralink was started to achieve all this. Now Musk says Neuralink is on the brink of witnessing these extraordinary capabilities coming to life. Now you will understand the intents. I'm super excited to dive deep into this and spill all the beans on Neuralink's recent updates. So without any further ado, let's get into the business on today's video. Hello everyone, this is Janani and welcome to Jan's Times. Elon Musk posted a tweet on February 20th that the human implanted with brain chip is recovering well and is able to control the mouse just by thinking. Within few minutes of this tweet, it turned the globe around and it had people freezing in their tracks. The update opened a whole can of questions. What's next? How's the future going to look? Even though he didn't show any evidence of the tweet, it is believed that this advancement will make a big deal in biology and technology fields. How did they achieve this? I will tell the whole story of Neuralink from its early days to the groundbreaking advancements in most simplified terms as 10 milestones. And after that, what I want from you is, I would like to hear your opinion on whether you are excited of this advancement or you see this as a threat to the human community. The first milestone was, in 2017, when Neuralink came onto the scene with a big idea, without inventing a new wheel, Elon Musk took the BCI technology, which has been around for decades. Predecessors like the Utah Arrays introduced metal square, no larger than human nail with copper wires and the metal chip that can be placed directly on brain's cortex. This was successfully transmitting the electrical signals. But this method had limitations, the threads are rigid and didn't allow strategic placement in the cortex. And it will be visible in the human's cap. Elon Musk and his team pushed the BCI technology beyond its boundaries and introduced N1 strategy. The threads are made in the size of micrometers thinner than a human hair and they are made flexible enough which allowed precise and strategic placement in the brain tissues. The second milestone is all about surgical robot. The threads of the implant are so fine that they can't be inserted by the human hands. The surgical robot has been designed to reliably and efficiently insert these threads exactly where they need to be. Neuralink built its own 7 foot tall surgical robot equipped with cameras, sensors and a tiny laser milled needle aiming to avoid creating any bleeding or scar tissue in a patient's brain. The third milestone was about implanting. Neuralink was ready with what to be inserted into the brain and how to insert that. Now they came up with the surgical process. After carefully targeting the implant site, a human surgeon will make a precise incision. Next, the surgeon will drill a small craniectomy to access the brain. The tough dura layer is then gently removed to prepare for the implant. Next is the surgical robot's job. The heart of the procedure involves inserting the N1's thin, flexible electrode threads this is where the magic happens. Then the implant will be secured in the meticulously prepared site and that's it. The implant sits snugly under the skin, all without the hassle of external wires or devices. The fourth milestone they achieved is upgradability. Every device in the technological world goes through upgrades. In every upgrade, they become more functional, they last longer. So the Elon Musk's team see the need for N1 upgrade as well in every patient. Many medical device organizations found this as a challenging problem. Why? To install the device, they need to remove the skull, dura, and the jelly kind of liquid to expose the brain surface. Then the device is placed. Now comes the challenging part. Over the months, all the empty volume is filled by tissues, which makes the explanting an impossible process. In 2022 show and tell, Neuralink team said, they found significant solution for this. During the implanting, they keep the jelly liquid as is 
and then place the device. Having said that, this made the surgical process a huge win and make the implant and explant simpler and safer. The fifth milestone is about demonstration. Neuralink's robots have performed 155 of the surgeries on pigs, monkeys and sheep in 2021 and another 294 surgeries in 2022. A monkey was able to play Pong game using only his mind and a pig could control movements showcasing the device potential to read brain signals, interpret them and execute commands. During this phase, Neuralink conducted extensive testing on animals to refine their technology. It's important to address their concerns were raised about the welfare of these test subjects, particularly monkeys. Reports surfaced about the adverse outcomes for some of the animals involved in early experiments. This sparked a wave of scrutiny from both the public and regulatory bodies, leading to thorough investigations. No conclusive evidence was found to support the claims of mistreatment and Neuralink has stated that initial tests were conducted on monkeys with pre-existing health conditions to minimize the harm. Elon Musk himself has commented on the matter, emphasizing the care taken in their research process and asserting that the advancements in the N1 device did not result in harm to the animals. Sixth milestone is about getting FDA approval on human trials. What is notable in these Neuralink projects are, even when someone has never had vision ever like they were born blind, we can still restore vision because the visual capability of the cortex is still there. People has no ability to move their muscles like complete spinal cord injury or paralyzed ones. Elon Musk believes they can make them operate a mobile faster than a regular person working with regular hands. Since 2019, Elon Musk predicted Neuralink would begin human trials. The FDA had pointed out several safety concerns to Neuralink that needed to be addressed before sanctioning human trials. Some of the issues involved the lithium battery of the device, the possibility of the implants threads migrating within the brain and the challenge of safely extracting the device without damaging the brain tissues. Because of this, there was a delay and the company sought FDA approval finally in early May 2023. Seventh milestone is about recruitment for the human trials. In September 2023, a groundbreaking announcement emerged from none other than Elon Musk himself through a tweet that captured the world's attention. He revealed that Neuralink was on the lookout for a very specific volunteer for its inaugural human trial, a quadriplegic adult under the age of 40. This call to action wasn't just limited to social media, it was echoed on Neuralink's official website, signaling a significant step forward in their mission. The response to this announcement was nothing short of astonishing. Against all expectations, a wave of enthusiasm swept through the community with countless individuals stepping forward to express their interest. Eighth milestone is about the first human trial. In January 2024, the tech and medical world were abuzz with an announcement from Elon Musk. The first human trial involving the Neuralink N1 implant had not only taken place, but the volunteer was recovering remarkably well. This news wasn't just a milestone for Neuralink, it resonated across the globe, sparking conversations and igniting imaginations about the future of human potential. It was released that for the surgeries on human patients, the preparation and craniectomy took a couple of hours, followed by about 25 minutes for the actual implantation. The ninth milestone is about success of human trial. On February 20th, a tweet from Elon Musk heralded a landmark achievement in the annals of human progress. The first human trial involving a Neuralink implant had achieved unprecedented success. This wasn't just a matter of the implant being well received by the body, it was actively communicating and receiving signals from the brain and sending responses back to a computer. This represents more than a technological triumph. It's a historic fusion of biology and technology, marking a new chapter in our understanding and enhancement of human capabilities. Tenth milestone is about Neuralink's future plans. The FDA has given Neuralink the OK to perform additional implant trials in 2024. The company says it plans to perform 11 surgeries in 2024, 27 in 2025, and 79 in 2026. By end of 2030, it is planning something like more than 20,000 surgeries. It is like increasing exponentially in the years following. This raises profound questions. 
Are we stepping into a bright future or are we treading into uncharted ethical territories? I ask the same question to you. What do you guys think? Are these advancements exciting to you or threat to the human community? Please share your thoughts in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. I will catch you in the next video.